Well, hey, hi, and hello. <laughs> I don't know what that sounded like, but you're welcome. Also, what the fuck, Bitray? Why are we having issues? You promised me you're gonna be okay. What the hell? <laughs> anyway, hey, hi, and hello, party people. Are you ready? Because tonight, we're going to hell. Oh, yeah. Oh, hell yeah. Andy, why are you wheeling in kegs of things? What the fuck, dude? Why? Why do you have so many kegs? Why don't I have a single keg? I don't know. The questions. We must all ask ourselves. All of us must ask ourselves. Oh my. No. No, orange juice gla- No. 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 It hurts my brain. It hurts. <laughs> uh. Also, what would orange juice out of a keg taste like? Would that- Like, would that be good? Would it taste like wood? Oh yes, I'd like my orange juice with a- with a hint of wood. <laughs> oh god. I don't know. <laughs> what are kegs made out of? <laughs> I've clearly never had a keg. I've never been around a keg before. <laughs> oh my goodness. I think they're aluminum? Oh. They're not very sturdy then. Do they need to be sturdy? Hmm. I want a wooden keg. Wooden- like a wooden keg seems... Fun. <laughs> Interest- I don't know. <laughs> it's in barrels. I mean... Okay. But call it a wooden keg. You know? <laughs> Maybe stainless steel? If they're stainless steel, at least then they won't rust? Maybe, right? <laughs> Watch me. I'm gonna get a wooden keg. I'm gonna use a little soldering tool. And I'm gonna solder the words wooden keg into it. I don't get invited to parties. That's why I have to create my own party. An after party. <laughs> Which, by the way, we're playing after party. Did you like that? Did you see what I did? <laughs> what has been- what- what has- oh my god. Oh my god. My brain... can't. Thank you. Why don't we... move on over to the game, shall we? This game is another game by Night School. The same makers of Oxenfree, so... If you were here for the Oxenfree playthroughs, like four or five, however many we did, or you've played it yourself, you've seen it elsewhere, you probably have a good idea of what we're in for tonight. All right. Ah! My, uh, my cord for my controller is far, far away. By the way, I hope everyone's having a good night tonight. A good day. Whatever the fuck it is where you are. Hope you're having a good one. And if you're not, it's okay. It'll get better, I promise. Getting through things is the hard part, but it will get better. So for now, just have a day. <laughs> These people, they, they kind of do. 
They don't have the great, the greatest posture. <laughs> I, uh, I read that and uh, I uh, straightened up. <laughs> I'm sitting all hunched over. I look like them. All right, you know, you don't have to call me out like that, Andy. Jeez, jeez. <laughs> <sighs> Before we get started, I'm going to take a sip of my green tea with ginger. By the way, what are you- uh, so what are you actually drinking tonight? Do you have orange juice? Do you have wine? A whole keg of water? Is it a wooden keg of water? What kind of keg do you have? Please answer all of my questions consecutively. <laughs> I guess that answers all of them. You got water in your water holder thinger. What the hell is a water holder thinger? <laughs> like a cup holder? What does it mean? <laughs> oh, thanks Discord me6. Apparently we're streaming. Wow. That's nice. Okay. How's our, why are we dropping in bitrate? Why, we were perfect. By the way, when I click off of the game, it, uh, it stops. <laughs> so. But not to worry, we're fine. Everything's fine. It's a 20 ounce clean canteen. Nice. I don't, do I know what that is? I don't know what that is. I don't think I do. Sounds fancy. Ooh, I just Googled it. That's a nice looking water bottle. Wow. Yeah, it looks really nice. Okay, get ads, go away. Wow. Oh, we need to double check the options. I, I did go through them. Okay. Just wanted to make sure that it kept everything. Because sometimes it doesn't, you know? Okay. Man, we're... What's going on? Like, our bitrate is going crazy. And I don't want to start the game and then all of a sudden everything dies, <laughs> you know? Ah, we just keep dropping. I don't know why. Why is it doing that? Okay. I guess we're gonna try it. We'll see what happens. Damn, that's a long time to have a water bottle. That's a weird sentence. I don't think that's actually a long time. What I mean to say is, it's lasted. No, that's still a weird... <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying. It's nice that it has lasted for almost a decade. Wow. I think I've mostly just had, like, the... cheap... kind of plastic shit. <laughs> so to me, that seems like a while. That's really nice. <laughs> Simple checking things. Sorry. Okay. Yeah, I don't know what's gonna happen, but let's begin. I did play through the beginning. Uh, well, I really didn't get that far. But <laughs> I, I played it just to... Rather, I let it play. So I could set OBS things up. But anyway, here we go. We'll just go on top of that because it starts from the beginning, so... Did any of that make sense? I don't know. The 800 millionth Hell Coming Dance featuring Lord Satan at the big house on Welkin Way. Tonight, tomorrow night, and every fucking night. I assume that's what that says. Well, this is it. Our journey has come to its end. Our lives as we know them. 
are over. What? Golly, we're adults now! <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> no, 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 seriously though. I just wanted to say thanks for coming out, fellow breathers. We are officially college graduates. So congrats, monkeys. There's beer in the pool, a condom in the fridge. Wait. And if you can't be careful, there's a clinic like three blocks down. They'll do Why you the cheap if you our promo the fridge? Code. Okay. We came, we saw. If we leave now, we can still make the donut place. Let's go before Whoa, we get recognized. Hello. I almost didn't recognize God you. God damn it. Hi, Allison. Can you believe we graduated? And what better way to end school than with an indigenous late century style mixer coupled with property <laughs> damage and substance abuse? Well. Oh, I love Oh, we're this guy. The, your outfit, Lola. You're always doing your own thing, which, you know, which I love. I don't know. This is sort of lame, right? How fun can a party be if controllers aren't involved? Ugh, I know. I'm so glad I was born after video games were invented. They're like Skinner boxes. Only if the mice paid with their time and currency to be trapped in the chambers, you know? Excuse me? Who wants to get drunk? Let's get a drink. Like, right now. Come on. The table's right. It's here. Oh, whatever speeds this process up. Oh, okay. So we're this dude. Oh, Look at our I'm hair. Sorry. This is my cousin, Katie. She's going to be starting here in the fall. Hey. I was just telling her about you guys, how you've been friends forever, like a weirdly long time. Everyone Are we... always thinks you're dating. Oh. <laughs> no, 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 no. No, never, ever, ever. I know now, but ever. Why would they? Why would they think that? Think that you're screwing? <laughs> I mean, somebody has to fuck the next generation of internet stars into existence. Um. Let's drink. Come on. They have them right over here. Okay. Are we getting that drink, Milo? So we're named, are, we're named, oh god, y'all, I can't talk, cannot talk. Okay. Our name is Milo. Are we Lars from Steven Universe? Because that's, <laughs> you know, I guess we're getting a drink. So nowhere else we can go. We can only go left to right. I like the way we run. Hi. Is this, is this where the, uh, the ales are? It's all $2 vodka mixed with $3 lemonade. Want one? Yes, please. Milo? Lola? Uh, it really helps pave over those awkward beats in the conversation. You could almost say it literally gives you more options in life. It's evolutionary, it good. you know? I read somewhere that monkey humans invented alcohol. In the same epic that the octopus got mm. that eighth leg, finally. Yeah, I probably need something to, uh, to settle me a little. Don't get too settled. I'm not dragging your ass through the quad ever again. <laughs> that shady chiropractor said my skeleton looked like a question mark. Yeah, so, do you guys want one? They're getting warm. Yeah, sure. Why not? Let's take okay, one. fine. I, uh, always take one if he does. And vice versa. We have a drink. So we can lie to each other about how drunk we're getting. Cup at the top right. Attention! All skin bags do not have to pay taxes. Please make your way to the dance floor. It's time to shake. <laughs> okay, <gasps> really quick. Give time to dance. Give me some life advice about higher learning. Mine was don't major in philosophy, law, any form of medicine, or theology, because those are all career suicide. Oh, and don't buy your books from the campus store. You don't want the clerk there knowing your pin number. <laughs> life advice. Uh, generally just try not to. Uh... Yeah, that's good. Thanks. Keep in touch. Wow. I don't Allison like her. Haynes, ladies and gentlemen. Like, why would anyone think we're... I was just as confused as you were. No, it's fine. Allison's just an idiot. Can't wait to read her posts about her summer vacay. <laughs> Drinking pina coladas out of some cruise boat magician's navel. She seemed fine. She was just, you know, happy to be done with this, I guess. Well, whatever. I'm not going to let that be the last meaningful conversation you ever have at school. No, if you want to go, we can go. Oh, no, 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 no. We're leaving. This is us just saying bye to some folks on our way out the door. So pick whoever looks the least stupid and make this quick. <laughs> you crack me up, though. This party's gonna be oh. now, listen. Oh, shit, we can drink. Uh-oh. That's you. That's what you sound like. <laughs> oh, shut up. You have me sounding like my mom dropped me on my head. Oh. Maybe she did. I don't know. Man, I will not miss this place at all. Not that I'm... I don't want to sound like I hated it. No, I know. It's just... I'm glad I'll never have another hot flash because someone's in my seat, that's all. 
<laughs> yeah, I think they are. Red solo cup string lights. Yeah, at least they kind of look like it. <laughs> oh man. Okay, so we barely take a sip and everything. Oh man. Okay. All right. Well, it's going to be okay, interesting. Billy, can we maybe, uh, how about we change the music up? I, I can't actually. They only made one song for the DJ. What does that mean? I mean, yeah, a sure thing. It just after this one's done. Oh no, this is the only song that they have. What, what about somebody call 911? Something, something about a dance floor. Whoa. <laughs> Oh my god, let's talk to this guy. What, have you ever thought that what you consider your personality is, is just the dream your unconscious body <laughs> is having? Because I have. And all my teachers said I was very smart. No, totally. <laughs> it's, it's pretty crazy that school's over, right? No more Tuesday cheese sticks. Sorry, this is Lola. I'm Milo. I think I... Didn't we have the same advanced frisbee class in... I know who you are. You're the one that gave blood and then immediately threw up all over the auditorium oh, no. in the annex. That... it wasn't that bad. <laughs> no, it was pretty bad. <laughs> yeah, that... that story just didn't go away, did it? Talk about a bad first day. <laughs> first impressions matter a lot. Yeah, intellectual yeah, man nickname, and woman. Right? The recycler? Chunkamunk. Or was it Colonel Shitlips? Well, it was nice catching up. Okay. Have a great summer. Bye. These people are rude. Like, what the that? hell? Okay, I know that could have gone better. Shit lips. I mean, Milo. <laughs> Who cares, man? Seriously, they're just being dick bags. Well, it doesn't feel that way. It feels like I'm a freshly born antelope just learning how to walk. I should know how to make adult friends by now. <laughs> you just make it so much harder yeah. than it has to be. I mean, what? Okay, Sven <laughs> fucking Gooly. You you go and talk to people and, and, and teach me. What did we call her? Show me the ropes. Let's I, I wanna see how easy it is. Let's let's see. Hey, if that's what you want. My trick is just remembering that everybody's born screaming in terror. Wait, Whatever it we takes, just chose go her? forth and show and me so, how oh, it's done. For her now. Sorry, I got distracted by this friggin' What the hell? Get out of my chat. Get out of here. All right. See you never. Jeez. Okay. All right. Let's uh let's talk to these people. Hell yeah, sushi. Hell yeah. Sushi announces everything. No, 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 no. When when the guy was all not today, and then the smoking hot chick was all uh. Right. And those effects! Oh, I couldn't even tell those were in his hands. <gasps> and the score? Oh, if he doesn't get his Oscar. Oh, forget the score, man. What about the sets? Talking about a movie? Let me guess, it was rated PG-13 for fantasy violence. Actually, you can say ass twice and still get the PG. I'm Lola. This is... Colonel Shitlips. We got it. Oh, my God. Come on, I... That was... Lola, did you say? Are you auditing a student or... Why are these people so rude? Some classes? And the school's not as good as the sites say, so... David, I gave yeah. you the Heimlich two years ago. I met your parents in the hospital. Remember, they kept touching my hair? Wait, oh my I, god. You went to this school or you're going to this school? Don't touch your hair. Okay, well, good to see you guys. Keep it... Keep it up. Bye, assholes. Bye, lip Bye Ebola. Oh my god. Milo, you wanted to mingle. Why are you sheepdogging me? Lola, they don't even remember you. The only reason they remember me is because I pooped out of my mouth once. I mean, how sad is this? We went to the school. These are our peers. Who cares what any of these people think about us? We graduated. Remember, we are done with these idiots. Why are we College here? was a non-stop, inescapable popularity contest where the winners rule over an imaginary world. You think anyone in society is going to care what they called you in we, college? We could have gone to, like, on your Denny's or something. What you did in the actual real world. Instead of coming to this party. <laughs> Everyone, hairy people, your attention, please. Stop the awesome music. Is someone named Milo and Lola here? Uh-oh. Actually, this is... That's probably two separate people. 
Milo and or Lola, are you here? Oh, I shouldn't have drank. Uh, yeah, we're. It was a bad idea. Here. I didn't have Milo, to. Lola, I'm very sorry to tell you this, but both your parents were just run over by a train. What? They were scissored in half, but the but, wheels are keeping their guts in place. What? But as soon as they move the train again, their intestines will fall out of their bodies and they'll die. The EMTs are keeping them alive so you have time to be with them in their final moments. What? It's their last request. Milo, come on, they're just fucking with you. Huh? I'm so happy it's Friday, right? Thank God I don't have to do my kegels. What the Ooh. hell? Holy shit! Uh, are, are you? Oh, oh. Uh, do you? Are you? Is what's happening to you okay? Or Lola? I... Oh, what's... fuck! Is this a? What the hell, dude? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at this. <laughs> They still think they're alive. They think they're alive. <laughs> what? I, what is? <laughs> Look at his dumb face. Okay, what the fuck is going on? You freaks should know that my uncle's a volunteer fireman, so I can get an axe whenever I want. You want to know what's going on? Well, we'll tell you what's going on. Hey, this what is the, the hell bad is going place. on in here? Uh, Mr. Madamantis, we were. Assisting in the transition I between. I hear it. I told you guys to wash the floors with pony blood, not fuck with the newborns. Not fuck Clean with the newborns. Shit up. I mean it. And Milo, Lola, you're late. Luckily, there's a processor down the road, and you better double time it if you want to get in before close. The uh, double, double time it. It means do something twice as fast. Uh, late for what? The wildly expensive costume ball everyone is apparently going to. Sorry to break this to you, but I'm not a parade float. What? The, what? You died. Died? Ten minutes ago. I'd head to the process station now if I were you. What? What the... I... Uh, okay. Let's, uh, let's go get processed. I... <laughs> what the hell, dude? And the rest of you? Put all this crap away. Some evil nuns are dying in a bus crash tomorrow. What? So, I want this place spotless. Hey, uh... I got tickets to the 19 Black Sox fighting a pack of wolves tonight. I can't really be doing overtime. The wolves have Toy Cobb, asshole. So spoiler alert, the Sox are losing. Oh my god. I Get don't the know why they're glowy, there. but it's cool. It should be gross. You should feel gross if you're cleaning right. We didn't even get to play darts. I can't. Do we have a step stool anywhere? <laughs> I was made to put bees in traffic cops' ears, not clean up party fouls you're you're probably used to this but i uh, we have a couple of questions wrong you want the door there i'm not a door go down the road the processor will explain everything okay okay right karaoke would exist in hell wow Milo, get a grip. Remember when Alpha Phi said you want a date with Jessica Rabbit? Yeah, they spiked my coffee with LSD and I made out with a rose bush. But this yes, and is yes. A prank, Lola. We'll try. Nobody put VR lenses in our contacts. This is really happening. Come on, Milo. Hi, hey, how's it going? Yeah, Tuesdays are always slow. The custodians get bored. You know how it is. But the processing station's just down the way there. Start walking. You can't miss it. Okay, so this way? Pro processing? Right. Damn it. I guess we can't explore I that way yet. I can't oh. even remember, like... When did we go to that party? Was there a party? How did we even die? I can barely remember anything. Look at this place. What? What are we even standing on? Is this a rock? Why, why is it sticking to my shoes? You know what? Screw it. I don't even... This has to be a mistake. We, we had plans. And people can't die if they have plans. 
And they can't get sent to hell if they babysat their neighbor's kids for free! Yeah, this feels like wine and sushi wrong. We should, we should, uh, ask the processing station guy. Hopefully it's a person, and not like an automated ATM. Uh, I just can't believe this is happening! Well, <laughs> Six guys. Be real. It oh just my god. doesn't make any sense! It's cheating! Probably. The whole universe shouldn't be that train station where I had my socks stolen! Hey, Milo, I'm as surprised as you are, okay? My mom made me go to church until I was 12. I mean, I, I just sat there and read Mad Magazine until I stopped hearing, Can I get a witness? Just, this is wrong. <laughs> Way wrong. And, and, and there better be somebody at this station whose job it is to file paperwork somewhere. And, and, and we'll, we'll get this. They'll fix it. It'll get fixed. We're, we'll be fine. Sure. You, you kind of paused there before you said sure, do you? You know that? It kind of makes it sound a little like you don't believe it. Yeah. <sighs> oh, that's cool. Wow, this place looks amazing! Okay, we're gonna live here. Hey, Chloe! Chloe is Sam, whoever the hell that is. Sister Mary Wormhorn. How do I... Okay. Oh, there we go. We just have to walk. That's it. You just have to walk. Ooh. Wait, wait, wait. Look at this. It says, The Scales of Judgment. Where Osiris weighed Satan against a feather in a drunken bet to see who gained the most weight over winter break? What? <laughs> Librarian. Hey, hey, either one of you guys, Jimmy Bolanger? James Whitney Bolanger? Tu t'appelles comment? No, neither of us are whoever you're talking about, so don't, like, hurt us, please. Wrong vocation, but don't worry, I'm not too insulted. Well, sorry to bother you. Have a good one. Everybody's so nice and friendly, except for the people at the beginning. Taxi? Ooh, we got a taxi? Hell is gigantic. Hey, hey kids. Hey, you wanna buy rug? Listen, I got dodecahedrons, punch mm. bowls, uh, uh dodecahedrons totally with St. Michael's face on them. Sorry, maybe we'll, uh, maybe we'll come back later. Yeah, they all say that. Processing. Okay. Marcy Sullivan. Oh, is Marcy it? Marcy Sullivan. Oh, yes. Here. Oh, Here. my. Marcy, how you doing? Mm, not too good. Yeah, yeah, I know. Just proceed down to table three, if you please. Thank you very much. Take as much. Take all day to get there. Yeah, there you go. Okay. All right, now. Lola. Lola Wolf. Is there a Lola Wolf here? Uh, present. Ah, oh, you still have your mouth. Great. Some people don't How have their mouth. How about Sang Bong? Is Sang Bong here? Andy, My same for me. Up. Sang too, it's Bong. Too long. Anybody know this guy? Uh, I... My friends usually call me Milo. Uh, a little overeager pluralizing friends there, but okay, sure. <laughs> this... Okay, this is weird. It says you two are going together. Uh, what does that mean? Proceed on to table two, please. Uh, I'd like to get home before my wife gets the good spot in the garage. All right, moving, <laughs> moving right along. Is there an We're Abby going here? together. Abigail Cunningham. Uh, he table two. Okay, that's, this must be us. You know, it's funny. I, I'm kind of, I feel like I'm sort of adjusting already. Like, I've just, 
I'm getting some level of emotional control, at least. Oh that... my god, Milo, we're dead. We're fucking dead. And we are in hell. Oh no. How is this not hitting me before? We are in hell and we are dead. Get a grip, Lola. You were the rock. Don't make me the rock. <laughs> okay, I can't be the rock. I am not fine. How was like I fusion? Fine? This this is insane. Are we gonna Literally, fuse? The worst thing that could possibly happen to us is happening to us right now. Hi guys, I'm Barbados. No relation to the island, which ugh, I hate that I even have to say that now. No. I'll be doing your personality audit before the processing commences. I have your file here on my phone. <laughs> Sorry, I'm coming from the gym. Look, we there has there's been a mistake. We don't we don't even know why or how we died, so... Yeah, you know how when you're a kid, you stop remembering your infancy past a certain age? It's because your brain reconfigures itself to make more room. Ditto here. So, when you pierce the mortal veil, only the important stuff stays. Phone numbers, the smell of your mother's hair... So, okay, so... Do you know how we died? I surely don't. No sir, no ma'am, not my department. I don't do collections. Wait, wait, make more room? For what? We're dead. And how? You're gonna be here for a very long time. Like, for eternity. Great. And a lot of new, mostly painful memories need their baby rooms made up before delivery. Which means the spank bank is getting converted whether you like it or not. Oh my god. Look, I know what this is. I've seen white guys bribe hotel clerks in movies. Okay? Just tell us what you want to let us go home. Hmm? Oh, sorry, I wasn't listening. <laughs> oh! Okay. Okay. This is novel. You two going together. Normally that's reserved for murder suicides and moms with albino sons. <laughs> but we'll tag team it, all right? Answer the following questions without thinking. Milo, regardless of the truth, have you ever suspected a lover was cheating on you? What? There are no wrong answers. Uh, no, not really. No, not really. Okay. Cool. Oh, no right wrong on. answers. Which image is closest to representing what was your ideal life? Uh, okay, even though I'm sure this is a trap, the exec running shit. <laughs> I would have guessed that one for you. Ooh, I would have. That's so funny. You guys, can I just say, you're doing really well. Really? Oh. oh Why did they do that? Ooh. Whoa, what is- Come oh, no. on, man. Okay, you see that head over there? Uh-huh. I, I mean, ugh. <laughs> All right, fling that thing up into the hamper like you're George Gervin. Excuse me? You want me to basketball that head into- Oh, my God. Uh, okay. Are you kidding me? Oh, no. We're kidding. <laughs> Oh no! Okay. Okay, ready? Fuck! Good job, is what I'd be saying if you'd made the shot since that Aww. was the test here. I'll just put you down as hands included, but questionable proficiency. But I was so close! Oh, but Long I- round. This is a word association, so just say the first thing that pops into your head. Okay. Ring. Ring. Uh, uh whatever. Lola, drugs. D what? <laughs> no, thank you. Milo, crowds. Crowds? Uh, uh, tired. Milo, I mean, Lola, break. What? Like taking a break? <laughs> ho, ho, ho. What could this be, hmm? All the way from the deepest, darkest broom closets of your mind. Lola. What? The reigning pride of your ceaseless sorrow, the sultan of revulsion, the drain on your brain. What is happening? In your shoe, you just can't get out. I give you your personal demon. <gasps> How in tarnation are you, man? I'm just so excited to be working with you, with anyone, really. It's, They're it's just, so I'm cute. So ready for this shit. We're going to be a team, a real partnership. I want you to know that. Oh, crap. There's two of you? Uh, I'm so sorry, little lady. I didn't see you there. But, uh. <laughs> oh, let me start over, okay? Whew. I'm Sister Mary Wormhorn, and I will be assisting you guys with your mental anguish here in hell. We're gonna be brain bunkmates. Yeah, hi. Oh, hi! 
Sister Wormhorn here is your personal demon. Slow down, Barbados. What does that mean? Well, it's a comfort inhibitor only you and other demons can see. <gasps> and wow. if so during your off hours, there's still somebody to nudge you into traffic sometimes. It's like Shinigami, hours. except well, not. What, is, uh, what does that mean? Sister Wormhorn? Wait. What? Uh. Okay. Alrighty. Uh. There's nothing over here. Cool. I really like the sculptures in the background. It's really awesome. Okay, if this is a hallucination, it's a sick hallucination. Hey, look at this place. It's awesome. Like, yeah, Dev, no, the fact that you only ate free range <gasps> chicken doesn't change anything. Okay, now that you have all been appointed your personal demons, we can now assign you your torture. Uh -oh. Your torture will take place during regular office hours by a certified sadist. Exempting holidays and Medusa's birthday, even though I don't know why we bother that, that bitch still says she's 39. <laughs> office hours? Do we, do people get, like, time off? Hey, Norma Ray, it ain't for the people, it's for the demons. You think getting whipped for 10 hours is hard? Try swinging the cat of nine tails all the live long day, you'll pray to trade seats. Abigail Cunningham. Huh. Yes. Your bones will be broken every day by a ball peen hammer for the sin of repeatedly misusing the express lane in grocery stores. But I oh. always have more than 15 things. Ah! Oh my god, Milo, she's Dev Sedana and Marcy Sullivan. Uh no. It's you. I we just did this like two minutes ago. He knows. Oh my god, Marcy, will you just back me up on something for once? Now, for robbing all those liquor stores, Dev will be suspended from a pole by his genitals. What? While children use your head like a tetherball, weather permitting. Marcy, your tits will be consumed by snapping turtles, only for them to regrow larger every day. Oh my giving god. Giving you intense back pain when you jog. But, but Ow. We, we only rob Jewish liquor stores. <laughs> what? Now, Milo and Lola, for the sin of... For the sin of being too late to get assigned to punishment, you get to wander the city until tomorrow. Have fun. See you later. I'm going to get drunk. Wait, come back. Where's the bar? Wait, um, what is, what's our thing going to be? Our, our torture? Our hours are nine to six, guys. Can't you just tell us now? Come back in the morning when we're open. Okay, but... But what are we supposed to do until then? Sightsee, meet people, might as well carve out your shitting hole. And hey, don't worry, you'll be having maggots forced up your nose soon enough. Well, what the hell are we supposed to do now? Hey, you two could have told me that guy got another ride. What? Bowlinger. Jimmy? I was looking for him earlier. What? The guy got another ride, that's all. You could have fucking told me. We're, um, sorry? We didn't know we were supposed to tell you anything. We just, we just got here. I'm just fucking with you. Sorry, you're confused. Uh, it's, I'm, I'm being mean. Okay, I'm a psycho. <laughs> oh, Friend no. of Urshanabi, Tooth of Phlegius, Charon's lost dog. Uh-huh. I'm a, I'm a cab driver. A ferryman, to be, uh, specific. Oh, a psycho pump. Uh, I'm sure the answer to this is no, but can you, like, ferry us out of here that depends where do you want to go home earth <laughs> um home topside earth if if that's if, if that's possible home mm. the props assist the house until the house is built yeah doctors do warn you that you don't get to take the drapes when that fastball catches the side of your head you're saying we're stuck here she's saying we're stuck here no it's it's just it's a tall order that's all Look, I just clocked in, but I need a fare. You guys look clean enough. You want to roll with me on a chore I got to do? Yeah. It's at first an Izzard. I got to see about a friend, but I'll introduce you to some people. Huh? 
I'm Sam, by the way. Sam Hill. Short for Samantha. Short for <gasps> Silithial Machidial. Are they talking Milo about us? Lola. They're tweeting about us. Mr. Milo? Miss Lola? I'm nicer than I look. What do you say? Oh, hell yeah. yeah the same feeling I did when that guy in the van tried to sell me a raccoon. I'm choosing to trust this. What the fuck else are you going to do with your night, right? Come on, my ride's True. this way. Won't be a long trip. Uh, so, Sam. Uh, oh, this is Sam. Oh, my uh, God. Huh. Yeah, the days have worn away, haven't they? It's like that voice is so I familiar because it's renew. Chloe. Dead-eyed and pig-tailed. So I guess I'll hit the questions yeah. everyone has. Maybe we First had of a all, raccoon. whatever church you went to, whatever faith, they were a little right and a lot wrong. And if you didn't go to church... Ah, <sighs> here's oh. my little bundle of joy. I cut her off. I should give her a name. Never really had the time, though. Or the desire. Hop on in. But mind <laughs> the leather. Oh my god, we get to ride the taxi. I'm so ready. Hey, beer stoop, how's it going? How are you doing tonight? Oh, okay. It's uh, the the seat's wet. Oh yeah, that's probably your end. Ew. Okay, everybody in? Oh Great. no 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 no. Oh no no no. <laughs> so you're dead. You're in hell. It's bewildering, I know. But like moving to a new place or cutting up a body, it's best oh. to just focus on one thing at a time. I thought so, it was a robot instance, too. What the fuck are we driving on right now? This is the River Styx. Hell it's yeah! It's a material, transdimensional spirit course that connects all the little islands of hell. Don't and fall in, chat. Very women like me, a job. Um, islands of hell. Keep hell your hands and your feet like inside, one okay? Big land what you think of hell is what's called the Nine Circles, the uh, conurbation where everyone gets tortured during Punch-In. But outside the Nine Circles is an infinite chain of islands we call Nowhere. Hmm. And it's what you're in now. God's coloring book, I guess you could say. Everything comes from the abstract, the abyss, the outer realm where he set his dark materials. It's a long story, longer than we have time for. Right now, at least. But hang tight, we're almost there. Okay. Cool. Doesn't it though? Like uh, okay, here we are. Watch your step getting off. I know sometimes you kids like to play at the shore, but you fuckers sink fast. So, and I ran out of the house without my flippers today. So just keep your eyes on each other's toes. Hey, I played water polo in gym class voluntarily. Okay, Milo and I can egg beater like our lives depend on it. I'm sure you can, Lola. I'm I'm sure that if you were on the Titanic, we'd have a lot more Polish people. Hey, hey, hey Sam, <laughs> Sam. What? Did you, did you hear the one about the blind guy who walked into a bar? <laughs> he walked into the table and shares next. <laughs> Get some better material. Oh my god. Wow. So, not that either of you asked, <laughs> but this is First and Izzard. I think the tourism board calls it the bludgeoning capital of nowhere. So, uh, use that information as you will. Just don't shake everybody's hand, is what I'm saying. And look at people's shoes when you talk to them. First and Izzard? Why is it called First and Izzard? How the hell am I supposed to know? Why is New York called New York? Good point. It's named after the Duke of York. Oh, Just thanks, kidding. Brainiac. Why don't you lecture us on what a rhetorical question is next? <laughs> Wait, why did we come here? If it's so dangerous, I mean, these are the types of people you think we should know? They're the only type you can know. If you wanted a different crowd, you probably shouldn't have drowned all those kittens. We didn't drown any kittens, okay? I would never do that. Yeah, you're pretty allergic. <laughs> Just because we're allergic, that's the reason we wouldn't. Oh my god. Um, what are you guys eating? Uh, no, whoever he was, he tastes like a prick. Oh. Okay, moving on. Hey, excuse me. We're trying not to get dumbass all over our pants here. Oh my god. Whoa, yo, Zerloka. Hey, hi, hello, and also thank you for the resub, yo. How's it going, dude? I warned you like 18 goddamn times. You'll get your stomach back when you learn to behave. Oh my god. Sam, hi, how's it going? Eh, pretty good, pretty good. Is uh, Forney in there? Fornius, yeah, he's fitting with his dick somewhere. All the kids with you? Yeah, they're cute, right? I'm playing tour guide on my coffee break. All right, well, anything happens, <laughs> I get their hair. Uh -oh. Smoky Smokey, who's drinking? Because I'm buying. Is Fornius like a, a, um, a demon drinking buddy or something? He's a middle manager in the fifth uh -oh. circle. 
Sometimes he makes requests, you know, specific souls for his department. I think some tech startup guy had a heart attack sport hunting homeless people in Portugal, so maybe it's that. Yo, Dunkmaster, hey, how's it going? <laughs> Why is sushi backwards? That, you know, it's a really good question. Um, and uh, I will answer it. Um momentarily it's uh, it's a great question it really is and i appreciate that you brought it up uh and thank you for your service and <laughs> hello <laughs> okay the short answer is i didn't notice okay <laughs> i'm not i'm not moving any i'm not going anywhere okay <laughs> but uh no i I didn't notice that that... Y'all, I'm pretty oblivious to things, okay? Anyway. <laughs> Hi! <laughs> We're in hell. Everyone. <laughs> Let's continue. So, whenever you're ready. You, uh... Let's look at this body. Okay. <laughs> uh, I think he's taking a time out. Don't kick him, Milo! What the hell? Oh my god. Oh, you know what? Yo, Professor! Hey! How are you doing tonight? Sorry, every time I click... Oh, no. Oh, no. And it's fine. Nobody panic, okay? So just ignore me. Everything's fine. But, uh... Hi! <laughs> uh, what was I doing? What was I saying? Yeah, every time I click off of the game screen... Um... You know... Things... Happen... Um... Oh no... <laughs> I made a thing. Oh no. Y'all, I made a thing and now it's not working. And why is it not working? I don't know. Oh, okay. There we go. Okay. So, okay. I totally forgot. <laughs> I was gonna, I was gonna do this thing. See, listen, last time y'all were talking about how I should change my hair or something for every character. Andy, I'm pretty sure you brought it up. And, uh, yes, yeah, that is true. Y'all talk about a lot of things, but I'm pretty sure it was you <laughs> that brought up that I should change my hair for, like, every character that I play, pretty much. And, um, that's kind of a lot, but y'all also got onto other things like that. No, I have it. It's evidence, okay? <laughs> Netsil, all right? <laughs> but, okay, so I was thinking, you know... Why not, like, why just change my hair when, okay, I keep clicking off the game, I'm sorry. Why just change my hair when I could do, like, a full cosplay or something? But here's the thing. My brain just completely stopped working. Anyway, I was thinking, what if we do, like, I don't know if this is going to work. I think it, I think I did it right. Up at the top there. If if we reach 30 subs, I don't have a deadline for it. I guess when we reach would be the thing. When we reach 30 subs, I'll do a Chloe cosplay. <laughs> what? Zerloka, I would never. <laughs> I would never, but I just remembered because uh, this character over here that we've been following, the taxi driver, Sam, is voiced by the same voice actress as Chloe, so there you go. I don't know. Or, I mean, we could change it to a different person, but, um... Saw the absolutely cutest piece of trash on the ground. Keep begging the hubby to get one ourselves. Maybe someday. Thought up an awesome new torture today. Just tell them how much their dog... <gasps> Misses them from heaven. That's so sad. Oh my god. 
anyway, I don't even <laughs> I don't even know if that's something y'all are interested in, but uh, so you can do it or not, but whatever. <laughs> But uh, I guess so we're at 18 currently. And apparently I set it up right because it said 17, but now it says 18. So that's exciting because I, I didn't know what I was doing. <laughs> there you go. I guess there's nothing else to click on over here. These guys are just hanging out. <laughs> Did you see this guy back here? <laughs> he just raised his hands. Ah! <laughs> I like how he walks. He's so cute. Okay, anyway. Yeah, by the way, I meant to have that at the top of the screen from the beginning of the stream and I forgot. I'm organized. Okay, let's go there inside. We can drink in here. A bottle for everyone. Is that crazy? It's fun, right? My balls hadn't dropped yet. How would I think that was funny? Boom. Just drink it. Don't even well, look at me. Well, if it isn't the smelliest pile of puke in all of nowhere, Samantha Hill. How the heck fire are you? Hey, Forney. Perfect timing. Guys, this is Forneus. Forneus, this is Milo and Lola. So you adopted two human children, and those are the names you gave them? I didn't pick their names. But you did adopt them. They're not mine. I'm just showing them around. We're not kids, all right? I got a savings account and everything. Tommy's having his party upstairs. Want a drink? You read my mind. Wait, Sam. Relax. We'll get into your thing in a bit. Just follow me. Uh, uh no, all right. I'm glad she's not leaving us down here. But also, we need to explore, Fornius, right? With one F, and we're just going upstairs to a oh, Tommy's death day not. party. See you up there, kids. Oh. Okay, I guess we can explore. What does it say? Memoria. Let's get a drink. Um, excuse me, bartender. Do you have like uh, a menu? Or... Okay, okay. Give me a second, miss. A woman ordered a bitter lemon drop, and I'm trying to remember if I got any eggs. Come back in a minute. Whatever. Let's just go upstairs with Sam, Lola. All right. Um, excuse me. Private party. But our friend just went up. Sam, she's on the list. You ain't. You don't even know our names. How do you know we're not on the list? I'm looking at you. That's more than enough information. Wow, this guy's rude. Tommy boy, the man of the hour. <laughs> hey, Father Van Dyke. Get over here. I got a new cocktail I need reviewed. Well, I'll happily be your willing test pilot. I think that's the guy having the party upstairs. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? I don't want to wear it. Get him to invite us up. Yes, let's get a drink. All right, Tommy. Sorry for the wait. What can I get you? <laughs> why did he? I don't know. Why did Milo do that? <laughs> What's, uh, what do you recommend? Top shelf. A case of lung batter just came in. Hey, uh, Tommy. Or, uh, Thomas. I, I should probably... Hey, can't you stupid pieces of shit see there's a conversation happening here? <laughs> Van Dyke, it's okay. They're new. You're new, right? How you liking hell so far? Was the suicide pact worth it? Or uh, eating 50 raw eggs? It's not the the worst place i've been to that gas station off of fremont i'll still you know i mean i don't know about you milo but i've seen scarier versions of hell and tales from the crypt <laughs> let's be fair it's scary i'm scared i don't nobody take it as a challenge she's lola i'm milo we're actually just trying to wait wait, wait, wait. you're new we gotta have a toast do a shot with me come on van dyke three brass bulls if you please sure thing if you ate before you got here, you might want to pre-throw up. And... sure. 
Our livers are unkillable. Might as well take advantage. <laughs> wow, really? Guys, you should be honored. Lola is not the type for spontaneous, uh, revelry. <laughs> Perfect. Let's go. Okay, cats and jammer kids, listen up. Above ground booze is watered down milk, but here, this shit ain't 2%. Father Van Dyke's been serving alcohol since Jesus was still overcharging for kitchen cabinets. Around the bend. Let's go. Cheers. All right, here we go, I guess. Ah, <laughs> uh, goes down smooth. Now, you should notice you feel a little empowered, right? Maybe a little freer? Or if you have eyeballs, you'll notice you have an extra choice floating around in your brain. Sounds just like college. But be careful what you order. Different drinks affect people different ways. Like, you know, for instance... Hey, Jim Jum! What the fu- What the shit is that you got on your head? <laughs> uh, sir, I I'm not, uh, Jim Jum. Ah, sure you are, Jim Jum. <laughs> Why, I even called you, you last, uh, yesterday morning? At night? <laughs> uh, buddy, we don't know any Jim Jum, okay? You got the wrong guy. Remember that the dance man when you scored oh, no. the points in the, uh, the, the wheelbarrow? What? Come on, guys. This is a prime opportunity here to really utilize your drunken spirit. You got a brass bull in you, so use it. You remember? Um, sir, <laughs> could we please? Have Are some... you still working at the House of Knives? <laughs> that hostess with the uh, <laughs> she's down to party, right? Oh, for Lucifer's sake! Will you tell this moron to fuck off? What was that? What's her name? Mary? Uh, I don't. <laughs> oh, we're, this is great. We're gonna hang out all night. Lola, little help. <laughs> Did you? <laughs> she took. You have your car here, man. Stammer mindlessly or mindlessly stammer? Let's drink. Yeah, I know. Hey, dickhead. Get the hell out of my friend's face before you start pissing me off. Jesus, you, you don't <laughs> oh, have to no. raise your voice at me. I know when I'm not wanted, I can I can read body languages. Oh, okay. Where's the latrine anyway? See you later. See? Having an extra little bit of confidence can really help keep the sailing smooth down here. Or, you know, it can get the shit kicked out of you. Whichever side the coin lands on. True. But like I was saying, brass bulls tend to make people a little ornery. But try different drinks for different results. Christ, they sound like a fucking car commercial. <laughs> T -t Tommy, are we having a rematch or have your balls not grown back yet? <laughs> hey, I'm coming over there, all right? Nice meeting you kids. Crap, we should. We're missing our chance. We should go ask him, right? I mean, he's our ticket upstairs to Sam and uh, her info. Um, yeah, but we should probably get a drink first. Don't have to twist my arm. Uh, barkeep? What's uh, on the menu this tomorrow's eve? A fine selection, let me tell you. Ooh. We can choose what we want this time. Bloody stool. Flirty floozy. Ooh. Rye whiskey, absinthe, cat oil, and rose petals. Hurts more on the way out. Great. Perfect. We've got famous last words. To, I guess... Oh, that's what we'll become, basically? Prison bully. Methanol colored solvents with a touch of sugar. Slightly more enjoyable than death. Wow. The Great Emathian. Liquid courage. Vodka, horse blood, demon radish. A favorite of Alexander the Great. And pair of anguish. Liquid courage. Originally crafted by Leopold II. Served over ice in a pint glass. Digestion aid. Well, there you go. Should we go with the vodka horse blood? <laughs> Is that your vote, Zerloka? <laughs> Famous last words looks pretty, but I feel like we'll just get really mean. Yeah, that <laughs> it just doesn't have anything. <laughs> Let, let's go hmm. I mean the rose petals <laughs> let's go with vodka horse blood demon radish 
Alexander the Great's favorite. Let's do uh, that one. The Great Amathian sounds pretty cool. The Great Amathian. All right. Don't eat the demon radish. It won't make you more drunk. You get that, chat? Girly, what's your poison? Uh, just same as him, I guess. Uh, I thought, don't the demons torture the humans? How come everyone's just hanging out like it's happy hour at Chili's? Look, nobody here wants to be doing what they're doing. It's a job. Oh, and happy hour at Chili's, that. though. Most people. And when your shift's over, you drink with whatever dangling eyeballs in front of you. The nicer ones, anyway. It's a job? Then who's the boss? I'll give you a hint. He co-wrote the Bible with Santa Claus. It's the big I am. The million dollar man. God. I thought we were friends. How could you not tell me? Why would I need to tell you dolls can't really talk? Can it, you two? I warned you once already. One more outburst. You and everyone near you are getting their feet nailed to the top of Mount Vasectomy. Oh, wait. Damn, Maybe can't walk past him. egg those two idiots on. The bouncer will have to deal with it, and then we can go upstairs. The bouncer will have to... T How do you even know that'll happen? Let's just talk in front of the bouncer. Like, the advanced... Hey, whatever you want to do, I'm just a uh, squirrel trying to... Trying to... Oh, never mind. I'll follow your lead. <laughs> Dick. <laughs> okay. Let's drink our drink. Hey, uh guys have, having a problem over here because maybe we can exacerbate the issue into a real disturbance i mean the uh, help with whatever your thing is look if you work here or something relax i'm not gonna get into a fist fight with this asshole i've been kicked out of enough bars in hell to know the punishment's almost never worth it i didn't think you'd take it so seriously how could i not take it seriously well, yeah i do work here buddy so it's therapy time or i'm tossing you out on your ass now what's the issue don't worry about danny okay He's just a little steam because he found out his favorite stuffed animal from childhood. Georgie! <laughs> right, Georgie. The talking platypus. Well, he could only talk because I was possessing it all the time. And you don't think that's a betrayal? Jesus, <laughs> I don't what know. A scary motherfucker. And I thought the shapes my slinky made were off putting. Yeah, you don't oh. mess with a boy's childhood like that. I mean, do you even like Norman Rockwell? Hey, it was a goof! It wasn't a goof to me, dickwad! Hey, if I have to warn you one more time... I'm sitting. I'm sitting. I got sent to an institution because no one would believe me. I still can't take a piss without carrying a spork for protection. Okay, okay, calm down. Jeez. I don't want the bouncer taking any of my good organs. And anyways, you asked me to staple your baby sister's feet to the floor. Boy, oh. this cavalier attitude towards your PTSD must make you pretty fucking bad. Right? It's nothing worth getting angry about. I just fooled you for nine straight months. That's all. That's it, you giant sack of shit! You're gonna regret making me love you! I mean, the drowning that farmer's kid! You'll never make me regret that. Hey, guess what, guys? What? You won. Wanna know what you win? No. Ten years in the throat cutter, and it hasn't been washed in centuries. Ugh! <laughs> Dirty! Hey, Van Dyke. Where's, uh, the nearest singles bar? Hey, my plan worked. The bouncer left. Let's head upstairs, talk to Sam before he comes back. Well, it worked, chat. Damn. <laughs> I guess this is not the singles bar. I don't know. This Where are we? Wait, is this even the same bar? Welcome, welcome to Tommy Tulaney's Death Day Celebration. I saw you two talking to Tommy downstairs. Are you a victim or a fan? Wait, that... The guy we were... That's Thomas Tulaney, the serial killer? Kidnapped, tortured, and killed 13 young men over a period of six years. Oh yes, my god. Bob. Never caught, though. But but he was... He was so nice to us. Yeah, you can't there really slaughter a litter of boys in total anonymity without a few social graces. Have you seen Sam? Yeah, she's over on the balcony talking with Fornius. Let's uh, hey, check to the for, right first. for coming out. Really, I appreciate it. I can't believe it's just been a year. Feels a lot shorter and longer, you know? Oh, definitely. Was uh, Companius not able to make it? 
I thought I saw him check yes on the Evite. He wanted to. He really did, buddy. <laughs> it's stupid. But he's gained so much weight recently. You're kidding me. That's not... No, that's not the reason. He, uh, he actually joined a gym, if you can believe it. And he didn't want to lose on the free days they give you for signing up. I guess they expire in like a week. So he had an extra week? Or less than a week. I don't know. You'll have to talk to him. Well, I'm just disappointed. That's all. It won't take long. How do you know it won't take long? Something like this could take all fucking week. <clears throat> Lady, gentlemen. Farney. Gah, that guy. You give him an inch, he takes a really long conversation. Sorry that took a while. How'd you even get up here? Milo here almost started a bar fight. <laughs> and the bouncer left his post. Is there anything but wrong lessons to take from that? Wow, I'm impressed. Phil got involved and you still have your feet? Someone up there doesn't mind you. I don't hey, know. We're, we're cool, okay? I, I, uh, I... Yeah, you obviously died jet skiing with, with supermodels. I, we can see that now. Listen, Sam, it's been a fun uh, hour, or however long we've been here, but we really, we really want to get out, if possible. We just, we want to go home. See that big mansion down the way? The one having the party? That's Satan's house. He throws a rager every night, invites the fucking universe, tries to keep everybody's spirits up. You see, Hell's been in a bit of a low period recently. And by recently, I mean like the last thousand years. Nowhere in the nine circles, they used to be a place of, you know, creativity. Of uncompromised refusal to go to bed when you're told. We were the scribbled in margins in God's field guide, you know? And now, well, now people just like to get shit-faced. And I don't really know who we are anymore. Okay, but why are you telling us this? I feel like I'm talking to my uncle about how great Brooklyn used to be. I'm telling you this because it deserves context. What deserves context? You see, chums, there's one old practice that's stayed around. And Satan has a standing offer to anyone that wants to try. You outdrink him, you outparty him, you earn his respect, he opens the door. And lets you go back home. Oh. Back to Earth. My God. Alive. To do whatever you want to do until you die of something else. Okay, well, has anyone ever, like, done it? Oh, sure. I mean, not since. When was Buddha farting around again? 500 years before Christ. Okay, well, there you go. And I think there was a velociraptor before him. Okay, so, <laughs> yeah, okay. Um, but you're saying the only way out of hell is out drink the prince of lies we call him the prince of partying down here but yes you have to out party the prince of partying okay easy we can do Lola, it Lola, milo welcome to the show now if you don't mind i got other fares to pick up so if you want to head to lucifer's now's the time well there's nothing else to do so yeah let's go yeah easy chat we can do it no problem That's right! Oh, hell yeah! Through the party of the week? No, the party of the year. <laughs> God damn it. Here we go. Oh, Andy, that's a good idea. How uh, long have you been a cab driver? Or a... Uh... A psycho... psychopomp? Oh, a uh, good long while. Since I've been here, really. You know, it's hard to complain. I get to meet interesting clans, such as yourselves. Drift in and out of people's peccadillos. I think my life would make a good CBS sitcom, you know? I don't go on many adventures, but... I feel like I'm always strangely getting involved in random folks' deaths. So, uh, ever take any famous people? Like, who would you say was your most interesting fare? What, like in the last year? Sure. I took a woman who had gotten sent to hell, the first circle, mind you, so it's not that bad. But still, she was sent there because she wore gold most of her life. Wait, seriously? Yeah, some book forbids it. I forgot which one, though. And God made it a tenant for, like, a weekend in the second century. She was the only one I'd ever met that was actually punished for it, though. If you throw it over your shoulder, then you can last longer than everyone Sometimes else. Sometimes hard to keep up with the tide. Anyway. Because since you're not drinking it. <laughs> you can drink a couple. 
you have to make it believable. You, you drink a few, and then once everyone else is a little inebriated, then you start throwing it over your shoulder, and they won't notice. Hopefully. Then you drink a, a few more. Or something. Just walk past someone whose feet had been twisted around their ears and Lord Satan in hell below if that ain't a mood. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh god, Andy! Well, is there a logo? There you go. <laughs> Does that answer the question, I guess? Hey! Hey! My skin sponsor. Our, our the guy that little... thinks no one ever cheated on him. And Aww. the gal that thinks she's gonna run a mid-level ad agency one day. Reach for the stars! Aww. Having a good adventure so far? I'm just about to clock in. Just wanted to wanted to let you know. Just so you're aware, I I'm really excited to hit the ground blazing. I like her. Uh -huh. And uh, what does that mean again exactly? Oh, uh, it means I'll be popping up here and there to mentally and spiritually agonize you. T to the best of my ability, of course. I'm still new. <laughs> Probably so just a like movie thing. Flies or, or like a dime store gossip kids. They flare up like fireworks from the Correa Imaginativa. The, 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 the pits of, you know, Unus Mundus. But they can only hurt you if, you know, you're, you're too poor to afford therapy. Yeah, it's hard, okay? Animals, uh, plants, give demons something to work with. Most organisms fear being eaten or not dying quickly enough while being eaten. But humans are afraid of, like, not making money. Or dying before using a sex swing. Like... <laughs> You people get nervous when you see a car drive on the sidewalk. Well, good luck. I'll try to act really, uh, sad or whatever when you show up with a picture of my favorite dead ants. Oh, come on. I think we could do a little better than that. Anyways, I'll see you around when you least expect it. <laughs> oh, Aww, quick reminder. She's so excited. Crowds. Against them. Y you didn't like them, right? Mm, whatever, I'll look at my notes. Bye! So cute. Alright, Sane's place is on Welkin Way. I figure you want to get there spittily lick if you're itching to get home before your oatmeal cools. Oh, so, oh! Uh, whenever you're ready, spittily lick, you'll no. Oh, that makes me physically uncomfortable. Spittily lick. Oh god, okay, no. Alright, let's uh let's meet uh Lucifer. Yo. Like a true necromancer. No one ever Next say time? that to me, okay? Well, anyway. <laughs> uh, no thank you. So what's uh what's Satan like? Do we do we call him Satan or the the devil? What's his Actually, am I caring too much about what Satan wants? I don't really like That's the normal saying either. Thing, right? <laughs> First of all, take a couple of breaths, okay? Morning stars used to the whole, you know, wow, it's really you. I can't believe it. Celebrity fawning song and song. Everybody falls into the reference trap. Cyrus the Great would have shaken his hand. I mean, you can't help it. But there's only two things you gotta know about the little horn, okay? The first is that him and daddy had a falling out after Lucifer thought he could run the family business better than his old man. He started the war, he lost the war, so he ended up here, in Abaddon, aka Hell, aka the place where it smells like a wet anteater even in winter. And second, he didn't make the rules, but he has to enforce them. Think of him like the first kid sent to detention and forced to become, like, a hall monitor. He knows he's a bit of a goober. That kinda he sucks. he doesn't like it any more than you do. But he still finds time to graffiti the bathroom every once in a while. You, um, you ever met him? Uh, you're gonna meet him in like 10 minutes, Lola. Do you really think I haven't met him yet? That's not saying yes. Yes, I've met the devil, okay? We know each other. Well? Uh, as well as anyone, I guess. As well as any fairy man, anyway. What? Did you two, like, <laughs> date or something? Yeah, sounds like it. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, no, sweetheart. Satan could find a way to kill a damn cactus, let alone a relationship. He's very, uh, committed to himself, let's say. Okay, I can see the lights. Almost there. Hold on. Is he like Jane Lynch's character Welcome in way. Glee? Last stop. Watch, watch, committed watch to himself? This place used to be 
You know, actually, never mind. You gotta do the hike. Might as well let you discover it for yourself. Luke's is the only house. It's the big one at the top. And remember, a night out drinking usually starts a little apprehensive. Songs of humanity secrets only you and your mates know the lyrics to. Have fun. Text me to any cab stand if you need a ride somewhere. Cool. I'm usually just cleaning up puke. So. Bye. You know, I always get nervous before walking into parties. Like, I get this idea that everyone's gonna turn and look at me right when I get there and just know that guy isn't cool enough to own a pair of sunglasses. Well, don't worry about it yet. See that giant ass line of people? I don't think we're getting in for a while. No, there's. There has to be another way. Well, let's check it out. <laughs> we might be. Let's. This let's is see. the line to get into Satan's party, right? None other. Uh, where's your sleeping bag and coffee pot? Good Hold question. It. Come on, guys. There's got to be some faster way. Haven't any of you seen Adventures in Babysitting? <laughs> if a bunch of white fourth graders can get into a jazz club, here's a faster way, definitely. We see people cut through every night. Some people. Let's just keep on. Maybe we can convince whoever's at the door to let us in. I mean, we don't even want to, like, party. We just want to outdrink Satan. Bada bing, bada boom. It'll take like 10 minutes. Uh, all right, let's try it. All right, chat, be on your best behavior in front of Satan, okay? Put on your cutest, please let me through the door face, all right? Um. Hello? Hi, I'm Gooseneck. I'll be your first floor carriage for the evening. Be it's super charismatic. The only way up. Uh, is this safe? Heights kind of give me a little anxiety. Oh, I'm very safe. My last inspection and renewed certification was three months ago by one Misha Vasily. Andy, what and the she hell? Would know better than anyone being here on account of shoving three different people down elevator shafts. Just let me know when you want to go up one. At least offer to clean it up. Going up. One. One floor. Up. Oh, shit. <laughs> Jesus. Whoa. Sorry, it's a little bumpy. I had quesadillas this morning. Ooh, quesadillas. Second floor. Dish mops, hand towels, and segregated washrooms. Just kidding. This obviously isn't a department store from the 40s. You're in hell. <laughs> yeah. What time is it? A half hour after you asked me the last time. I mean, how long have we been standing here, jackass? Standing in line or standing in this exact spot? Pick one. Uh, this exact spot? Something like two days. And how long in line? I don't know. I remember people were really excited about faxing things. Hey, fax my ass! God, I don't miss the 80s. Is this the foundation of a house or something? I thought only Satan lived here. Well, yeah, now. But back in the day, this place used to be the fucking Grover's Corners of nowhere. Yeah, wasn't just Satan. His fallen angel pals and him used to have the whole block. Well, why'd they move? Eh, some folks just like switching up the zip code every thousand years. Who knows? Maybe... You know what, Andy? Yes. Yes and yes, I think. <laughs> I was gonna say, maybe it's just a bench, but, you know, I don't... I don't think it is. Let's... Let's go up another floor. Hi, we'd like to... Yes, I'm perfectly safe. Christ. We all get inspected every 90 days. Do you think demons can only hold jobs they're unqualified for? What? No. <sighs> Whatever. Uh, sorry, but are you, are you, aren't you the exact same demon on the first floor? Beers too, welcome Phenia, back. The second floor carriage. Ah, oh, different, different name. Okay, we'd like to uh, go up, please. Hop aboard, Slim Jims. Head it on up. Nobody fall out, okay? Oh, all right. Take, take it, take it easy. I can't control the weather patterns, ma'am. And turbulence accounts for only two percent of falls. <gasps> Is that a Ferris wheel? Third oh my floor, god! Everybody out! Oh my god! Do we get to ride the Ferris wheel? Oh my god! Oh, beer stoop. It's a tragic I'm going day. On a picnic, and I'm bringing apples, bananas, carrots, donkeys, earworms, footballs, and 
There's a time limit here. What comes after F? G. I'm bringing... uh... shit. Time's up. Gadzooks! I'm... I'm, what I'm bringing Gadzooks. Gadzooks. That's not a thing you can bring. Well, let's change the game up. Come on. I'm sorry I'm being whiny. It's just my arms are starting to weigh me down. How about 21 questions? Only minerals? Fine. I'll, I'll start. I'll think of one. Ooh, just, uh... Now, give me a minute. Hey, so this Ferris wheel for my nightmares looks like it's seen better days. Did the, uh, the other fallen angels, the ones that used to live here, uh, use this or something? Oh, yeah. They used to throw crazy block parties every night. Until they had, like, falling out or something. Over what? We're definitely sure we definitely don't know. Jeez. That's a fact. Oh my god. Oh, we don't get to ride the Ferris wheel? Okay, hang on. I gotta go back. I gotta make sure. We gotta make sure we don't miss the opportunity, you know? Maybe we ride it back down. Hmm. Hmm. Hey, yeah. Uh, can we, uh... First of all, I'm not the same demon. I know you motherfuckers all think we look alike, but I'm Spandrel, the third floor carriage. No, 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 we... we don't... And second, yeah. I've been inspected, honey. Oops. What, you want to check my ass for tags? Check no. my balls, see if I've been fixed? No. Okay, we, we're getting a little in the weeds here. I, um, we're sorry, okay? We're just, just trying to get to Satan's house. Oh, it's all right. It's just, this is my shit I'm unloading on you. Don't, don't worry about it. <sighs> it's been a long night. Oh, poor guy. It's closing, going on up. Jeez. Sorry, dude. Oh, why didn't Satan just make more stairs? Because Satan Whoa. likes to keep demons employed, that's why. Fourth floor, get the fuck out. <laughs> oh. Fourth floor, get the fuck out. That guy's my favorite. Wow, look at those skulls. Can we... I want to get in one. So, what happens when we get to the top and we don't get in? Uh, ha hello. Hi, I'm Ballister, your fourth floor carriage. Want to go up? Great. Great, that's... yes, thank you. Your, um, associates seem a bit on edge tonight. Only the Look bottom and that. top floors have bathrooms. Uh, Holy okay. hell! Chat! We're gonna move in here, okay? Fifth We're gonna floor. live here. The tippity top. This is our new home. This is our base. Welkenway. Everybody out. That's amazing. Th exactly. What else bad can happen? Th th you know. <laughs> oh shit, Jerry. I, I mean Terry. Baker's blowing up. Ugolino has an extra invitation. Um, sorry, but what's... What's Bicker? It's the social media down here. Look at your phone. It comes pre-installed. Bicker. <laughs> there, see? You can get good info on what's going on in hell. Andy, Yo, damn uh, it. What's the commercial Marshmallows? Say? Geotagged, user-specific. It's a nice way to distract from the perpetual torment. Or to just post pictures of your pets lying in sunlight. Cool. Thanks for the tip. Yeah, no problem. Now back at the line before I cut you. Hey, have a good stream, Professor. Hey, it's Milo and Lola. Still on that mission to get out of hell, huh? I'll just be going into the party now with my special uh, VIP invitation. Warm more and take us with you. Are you coming? Oh, wait, you can't. Um, hey, can we can we go in with you? You can, like, mentally torture us in there if you want. <laughs> Uh, can we just go in with you? You can, like, mentally torture us in there if you want. 
Laugh at him, ladies. <laughs> <laughs> Screw that thing, Lola. Let's just check Bicker and find other people with a spare invite. Okay, cool. Look, here. There's... Uh, I see two of them, and uh, we only need one. <sighs> Whatever. We'll take what we can get. There's... There's a demon who says he needs help apprehending someone. And a woman, Linda, who says she has an invite to give away. Linda! She just wants someone to get her a drink. This'll be downright easy. Yeah, this is not gonna be that easy. See this huge line? If it was that simple, they'd all run off and bargain with these losers. Nah, they're all just... Wasn't it you who told me about that test that proved people would wrongly stand in a longer line just because everyone else was doing it? Mm, wasn't me, but whatever. It beats waiting around. Let's get back and text Sam to pick us up. Want to go all the way to the bottom or take the long way? Oh, all the way down. Express, please. The full ride. You got it. Check your ankles, wallet chains, uh, purses. Okay. Wallet chains. The chains what? hanging off my trip jeans. We have to ride the Ferris oh, wheel at some point. They are really sore. They got me pushing boulders up mountains all day now. It's good for your hamstrings, but some cardio wouldn't hurt, you know? What? Well, your feet are sore. You're not the one wearing heels. It just... It gives you a little oomph. I like it when you're taller than me. I'm just saying, heeled boots for a guy isn't the best anniversary present. It's the equivalent of giving a woman the number to a plastic surgeon. I love you, honey, but what I'd really love is for you to have bigger tits. <laughs> oh my it's God. not exactly the same thing. Hey, do you guys know what the, uh, the falling out was between Satan and his friends? The, uh, the other fallen angels that used to live here? Don't know. And as long as it keeps the foot traffic away, don't care. Don't know, don't care. How's that? So, all partied out? Normally people are more covered in blood and viscera. But Ew. far be it for me to tell you how to live. Hey, Sam, you could have warned us about the eternal line to get in. I heard someone talking about the fucking Joe Law Empire. That shit hasn't been around for like 500 years. Oh, we have a plan, though. There's some people have invites, and some people have uh, have spares, so... so... you wanted to get invited to cut the line, yeah, I don't need the damn transcript. Whose tree do you want to shake first? There's a demon in uh, Bobblin Park who says he needs help catching somebody. But there's also a human woman who just wants a drink. But we know so... it can't just be that, or else it would have already been done. So... Ah, classic case of too many good ideas. It's a prettier's ball again. Uh oh. Guess you got some picking to do. Wow. This is our map? Okay. Wow, all right, um, you know what? Let's go. Oh. I don't remember where they said each of them was, but this, that place over there, the little, what is it called? That place looks interesting, let's go there. Let's see. Get an invite from a human named Linda. Okay. Hey, twerps, got an extra invite to Luke's house. Jam for anyone who wants to get your old pal Linda a margarita. She just wants a margarita. Chat, we could do that, right? Let's see. Yeah. Right? How do we. Oh. Go. Let's, Let's do it. Linda first, right? I know it sounds too easy, but maybe it is. Oh, I just want on the record that this is a trap, okay? A trap of inconvenience. Probably. Yeah, not like crazy fans of Linda, right? Because she's not too big into autographs or meeting people. Why would we be fans? Did she like murder a, a deposed baby king or something? 
She used to be the lead singer of that witchy witch band, Mercury Worm, back in the 70s. But you really think she's gonna give us her invite just for buying her a drink? Uh, maybe. If that's what she said, she could use the company. But, you know, it might not entirely be up to her. What does that mean? Eh, let's leave the spoilers till your second playthrough. Excuse me? What does that mean? Let's leave all the annoying questions till then, too, okay? Next up, little on Talia. <laughs> Y'all. Listen, Oxenfree had ten endings. This is by the same people. How many endings do we have? Hey, so, speaking of, like, uh, music, <laughs> was any of that stuff about playing records in reverse to hear satanic messages? Was it real? Oh, yeah. And not just records. TV shows, commercials. You know bus stops have those automated recordings? Play them backwards and you'll hear Satan whispering Chinese nuclear codes. Oh. But Lucifer <laughs> and Rockstress have a real history. It's true. Something about needing to... To scream your ego out into the conjectural void is really attractive to unhallowed spirits, I guess. Is there music in hell, like, different from Earth? Like, has the chronographic and ethnological <laughs> diversity in a supernatural environment developed unique harmonic genres? No, just like, what kind of fucked up music do demons make? Oh, every song's about one thing, doesn't matter who's making it. Why won't Tina call me back? But music, the creative arts, has always been a thing for the damned. Slavery let the self-possessed event crap like trumpets, and it's hard to really break from that lineage, you know? Anyways, we're almost there. Don't let on that you know Linda. She's kind of embarrassed about her solo album, Helicopter Fuckhouse. Chat, don't talk about her solo album, okay? Nobody mention it. It'll make her upset. We just need to get the invite. We need to get her a drink, get okay. the invite, and get Little out. Ron Talia, here we are. One of Hell's oldest districts, founded, uh, founded right after the war. Lots of relics, landmarks, a carrot juice bar just opened up on the other side of town, and, uh, oh, the dirty hurdy-gurdies just down the road there. That's where Linda said she wants that drink, right? Yep. Okay, kids, text me if you need a ride. Have fun at music camp. Thanks, Sam. You're the best. Actually, now that I'm thinking about it, I think I have heard of Mercury Worm. Yeah, didn't they reinvent themselves in the 80s, becoming some synth monstrosity? I've told you this a hundred thousand times before, but... But it's always been a dream of yours to be in a band. Yeah, I mean, I don't know if you remember, uh, but I tried in that one talent show in sixth grade. I played a uh, harpsichord and classical oh, trumpet. Told yeah, I think it was a good decision to retire from performing after that. Hey, come on. I, That's... I know an educational jam band isn't to everyone's taste, but I think some of the faculty, or at least Mr. Thompson, liked it. He was nodding his head, at least. Oh my, okay, I'm getting distracted. It's just so embarrassing. Choices. Being up on that stage, getting booed, or uh, make friends. But maybe I'm just being melodramatic. Look, Milo, kids at that age are just dick bags. I mean, what 12-year-old's even heard of metal machine music? I think that was the music teacher that said that, but the point still stands. Andy, thank you for the couple gifted subs to Dunkmaster and Professor. Thank you very much. We are getting closer. It's true. By the way, I should have said... Uh, did I say that? I don't remember. I don't, okay, my brain stopped working. Um... I was thinking if or when the goal is reached that I will do the cosplay for the next Life is Strange stream. I don't remember if I said that part or not, but that's what I was thinking. I don't know. If you have a better idea, please let me know because I don't know what I'm doing at any given point in time. <laughs> hey, Shonda, I know you're still reading these. Yes, I'm having the time of my fucking death. Oh, I missed the other one. Where are we going? Sealed knot? No. But what's that? Can we... I don't think we can go.
Wow, look at that. Okay, this this place is kind of awesome. <laughs> Dirty, hurdy, gurdy. That's where we need to go. Oh my god, a punch dispenser? Dude, okay, I'm down. What if it's like cranberry vodka? Like a cranberry vodka drink just, just back there? Sounds really good to me. <laughs> do y'all like that? What, if you, if you do drink, uh, what drink do you go for? Every mother words in my bricker post jeeps getting what? Me, 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 me. Look at me. Hello. Follow me, please. I'm funny and insightful, please. <laughs> Gregorian chant. Oh my. Okay, I have to look that up, because I don't think I've heard of that before. Running all kinds of stuff tonight. Okay, lads, let's try it once more. With vigor now. You two, you there. The ebony woman and the lemon man. Hail and well what? met. Well met. Hail and well met. Hail and Fuck well off! Met. Fuck off. I get enough racist cat calling at my therapist's office. Thank you. All our sincerest apologies if we've offended you. We aren't up on the modern descriptors. Do you, uh, do you guys need something? That is so kind of you to offer. We would indeed humbly ask for your assistance. Yes, could the Ethiopian please pick up the small whistle-like contraption resting there at my feet? I'm afraid that's our tuner. Hadrian here dropped it. One's hand tends to get sweaty. Much like one's <laughs> A is most assuredly a C sharp. <laughs> that's, a, that's a tuner, and you really need this that bad. One of us needs it that bad. But if you could please hand us the fallen vocal adjuster whenever convenient, uh, we'd be most appreciative. Oh, thank you. <gasps> we can kick it? No, I don't want to do that. Oh, it's like, why can't I move? Here you go. Oh, you've done it. A surprise for the ages. Thank you so much. We certainly appreciate it. Even Longinus here is eternally grateful. I'm grateful to be true, but let's not engorge the phrasing here. Thank you. Thank you. Sorry, I was looking Thank at gin you. and tonic. Althalos, you're still flat. Uh, what chant should we perform now that we the have The Mass our... of the Angels. That one has um, unripened for me in the past hundred years. What about Starbert Mater? I... Well, maybe it's my upbringing, but I, I think it's better when women perform that one. Well, then you pick the damn music then. No, no, no. I, I don't want to pick. It it's... It can... It can be whatever you want. Whatever I want. Like the Italian restaurant last winter. I ate the lasagna. What more do you need? I need you just to voice your opinion so we don't argue about laundry detergent every breakfast. <laughs> okay, let's just... Uh, let's think on it a bit. Uh, quietly. <laughs> well, alrighty then. Um, that drink sounds really good. I've never tried gin and tonic. But that is something I would like to at some point. And I've definitely never heard of that brand, but interesting. Sounds good. All the pictures, like I googled it, all the pictures look really good. <laughs> really haven't tried that many things. So that's the place we need to get in. Getting like a hard rock cafe vibes. 
when you think someone's your friend, but it turns out they only see themselves as your friend. I don't know what it's. <laughs> the dirty hurdy gurdy. Well, by the looks of it, they serve a lot of lukewarm salmon. After you. Oh, no, no, no. After you. Here to the end of the story. Think that lonely looking woman with a haunting stare and perfect cheekbones is. is Linda. Yeah, you could have just said the one with the guitar. Yep, that's Linda, <gasps> all right. Oh, don't be scared. We're just the accursed souls of dead musicians, forever trapped in this shithouse of schlock by that wretched virago, Ono Skellis. Oh, uh, who's. Uh... Ono Skellis, the grand negotiator, the band manager of Hades. And the fallen angel that owns the bar you're standing in. But if you want to talk to Linda, just take the cute purple mile down to the end. Can't miss her. And be sure to check out our gift shop. <laughs> oh. Hey, uh, listen, the gift shop. This is gonna sound weird, but with Linda, can I, like, do all the talking? Why? It's just, I've never gotten to be that guy, you know? Ordering a woman a drink, sliding it across the bar. Hey, if you want to practice your cold calling in bars, be my guest. Just remember why we're here. Awesome. Yeah, no, totally. Eyes on the prize. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Sorry to, uh, but I have to ask. Why are you trapped here like a glittering fish in a very depressing aquarium? Oh, a sample of platter of reasons, really. I challenged Ono to a fiddle off. Lost. Because <laughs> I forgot I don't know how to play the fiddle. I sold my soul for a number one hit. Died of a chocolate overdose not ten days later. What? Uh, to be... Uh, to be fair, I ate that much chocolate because I was on a lot of heroin at the time. Uh, oh and I God. wanted to be the best guitar player in the world. Ono made it happen. And then I suffocated in a 52-person orgy. I'll be sure to uh, Damn. check out your guys' stuff when I get my streaming subscription back. Yeah, thanks for the nickel. Mm. <laughs> we might, maybe, I mean, I wonder if we can romance anybody. <laughs> hey, what is it, what's it actually like being famous and playing music to huge crowds? What do you think, getting courted by supermodels and having throngs of thousands sing your words back to you feels like? Um, pretty good? Wrong! I took a hollowed out rhinoceros horn of coke every morning just to face my butler. Getting validated from forces outside your control leads to beating up a bouncy castle because it looked at you funny. Seek acceptance from within, my friends. And if you can't, please buy my newest DP out tomorrow. <laughs> It'll... It'll do the trick too, I promise. Wanna get like a hat or something? I already have the song remains the same on DVD. Nah, I'm good. I don't think we'd be able to take anything back with us anyway. I mean it does though, right? Is it like one of those obstacle course bouncy castle things? Does it look like an actual castle? Do you ever think you maybe should have just tried your best without the aid of a demonic power? Um, actually, sometimes I... Fuck no! No, never. Yeah, actually, no. No, we don't. We were on top of the world and lost it all. Only kings and presidents and the handsome people who are extremely lucky know what that's like. Wouldn't trade that shit for heaven. I mean, have you seen what they wear up there? Nope. We're in hell. Alright. No, the Salem witch trials were actually right. They just killed all the midwives and missed us. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, hey, uh, excuse us. Is anyone here familiar with Linda Landon? Oh, uh, yeah, she's playing here tonight. That's why we're here. What about you? 
Oh, no, we're yeah. huge yeah, fans. We're big, big fans. huge yeah. fans. Yeah, we, uh, we committed some pretty heinous crimes against God and man to see her play tonight. <laughs> cool. Yeah, us too. I mean, those babies won't eat themselves, so... Oh my god! Have you um, seen Linda around by chance? Maybe doing pre-show autographs? She's hanging out over yonder. But she hasn't done an autograph since 96. Yeah, the Sharpies down here scream when you use them. Good to know. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I didn't get a drink. <gasps> <clears throat> Hi, um, are you? No, I won't take a picture with you or sign your femur. And I'm kind of in the middle of something. Uh, want a drink? I can... Seriously, kids. If you want to chat, the least you can do is get me a margarita. Totally didn't get a drink. I'm an idiot. What was I thinking Great going over there? Sports, and, uh, do you have anything with honey in it? Yeah, we have six drinks that contain wasp urine. Four bomb squads. I'll send them over to your table. Next. We're fresh out of priest bladder, but what can I get you? All right. Margarita for the lady. Hell yeah. Wallen's Margarita. Tinderbox gin aged in the carcass of an alpine... I can't... Y'all, I can't pronounce anything. <laughs> but it's oddly sweet. A Wallen's Margarita sounds good. Excellent choice. Wallen's Margarita. It's cliche to say the room is spinning, but fuck it. I'm drunk. Thanks, Wallen. Alright, we're gonna get it. We're gonna give it to her. It's gonna be great. She's gonna love it. She's gonna give us that invitation. And we're gonna go into Satan's party. Wait, what was the last drink we got her? Linda likes Wolin's margaritas. I'll send over one on the house. Thanks. Sweet. Okay, let's go. Let's run. Run. Wait. Okay, now we're ready. Now we can go. Hi, I'm uh, back. Yes, I can see this is happening again. Lucky me. <laughs> We're not gonna assassinate Satan! Got you a margarita. The menu says it's oddly sweet, just like me. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Milo. Sure. Well, the walk there and back earned you at least two minutes. Have a seat. All right, we I'm can Linda do this. London, former lead singer of Mercury Worm, current denizen of the Fourth Circle. But judging by your starstruck faces, I'm sure you already knew that. Not that I would, you know, care too much <laughs> if you didn't. Yeah, I can't say that I've heard of you. Unless you're not badly mispronouncing. <gasps> Why did we say that? Oh band, no. Are you? So I take it you're not in town for the reunion at Satan's party tonight, then? Why would I what say that? Oh, Jesus. Okay, some backstory. Mercury Worm was my band, obviously, but we broke up. And in my discerning absence, they added a keyboardist. Yeah, it will. started collaborating with 15-year-old DJs. The fuckers took a fame rocket ship to Planet Coke and Hookers. But they all just died in a plane crash, like, a week ago. How romantic, right? But they're the hot new diarrhea, so Satan booked them for his house party. Tonight. Maybe all the album covers posing with drugged white tigers finally bit him in the ass. In other places. Why'd you break up? Was this a George Michael got too big for wham sort of thing? They were assholes, that's why. Well, that and they wanted me to stop trying to rhyme orangutan in every song. Wait, Linda, just... <laughs> if you have a spare invite to Satan's party, we could really use it. See, now that's a problem. When I split from the band, I pledged my eternal soul to Satan for a solo career. And it worked for about six months until my 27th birthday when I died parasailing down the Detroit River. Now, part of my infernal contractual agreement is to perform shows here and ones tonight, so I can't go. But... And neither can my invitee, since you'd need to, you know, come in with me. They won't let you in without me there, see? Well, then why the hell did you say you had a spare ticket if the other person can't use it? Honestly, I just got tired of getting up to go to the bar. Oh well, my god. Quarterback this. You said there's a contract, right? Well, shit, people get out of contracts all the time. My uncle Jeff thought he had a prenup. He's living in a van in Reseda now. She took his damn hamster. Guys, look, what if we just, we found a loophole or, or a replacement? 
Come on, give us something here. Oh, it would be nice to be there when Mercury Worm falls on their faces. Okay. If you want to try, you can try. But you gotta deal with Ono, my manager. She owns the bar. She's downstairs right now, probably looking at another undeveloped talent. Good luck. You somehow managed to pull this off. I'll, uh... I'll be here. We'll be back before you can say Mercury Worm. <laughs> Mercury Worm. Come on, that wasn't fair. Wait until we actually, like, leave. So, she's downstairs, she said. This place is a basement. Surprise! It's also a music venue. They dug a big shithole in here and shout out a stage. As for Ono, you can't miss her. She'll probably be yelling at one of her bedraggled assistants. We'll uh, keep that in mind. Thanks. We'll be back. Okay. Right. Oh, no. Let's just sweet talk her downstairs and get Linda off leash. Roger. We can do this, y'all. We can do it. We're not gonna assassinate Satan. That might be true. All right. That that might be true. You can rearrange, but we're not gonna assassinate him. I I mean. Yo, yo, I'm Verona. And I'm Peyton. And together, we're Black House. And we're here with a new single off our mixtape. Not literally a mixtape, but a thing you can get with a download code if you follow us on Bicker. It's called I Get Mine. Drop the beat. Excuse me, sorry, don't mean to interrupt. We're just gonna interrupt. Thing. Excuse me, what is this? Who are you? We're in the middle of an audition. If you can't already tell, and I doubt very much that Black House appreciates the intrusion. We, uh, we came here to talk about the existing infernal contract you have with Linda Landon. Any inquiries into talent availability should be made at the appropriate times with the appropriate vendors. Oh, we're not talking about. Even if it would save your mother's life, I wouldn't take the moments to learn what you're talking about. Now, church my scurry and you're in a hurry, so get out. What? Uh, uh, don't, don't mind him, kids, little Chattanooga choo-choos. Valak couldn't find the right spoon for his cereal this morning, so now he's a little ill-tempered. Mm. They don't have... An, there's no meeting scheduled. Uh, hey, just hit the pause button, okay? Give us a break here. You'd give a fucking rock a headache. <sighs> Fine. We'll continue this shortly. But house, thank you. I'm Ono Skellis. Some folks call me Ono. That's my auxiliary, Valak. He girds and guards my affairs. I prefer the term executive. He peel, girds but... and guards. And you are doing a book report on Linda Landon's autobiography, Does the Hyena Cry? The Linda Landon Parable. That didn't really fly off the shelves, if I remember. Look, Ono. Linda really needs a break. I know exhaustion in the entertainment industry is code for I ran out of my horse tranquilizers, but this is actually serious? She's already dead. How can it be serious? She... Now, what is this really about? Come on, my stopwatch is running. Linda needs to take a break. And why does Linda need to take a break? Speak quickly now. Hey, honey, <laughs> why ask why? When it's so much more fun to just say yes. So Linda Landon needs a break tonight. For some vague, infatigable reason, I'm sure is quite beyond my levels of understanding. And your father's label maker said what on your toy chests? Milo and Lola. Milo and Lola. Valak, how many years left on Linda's term sheet? Roughly 10,000 years. Linda got a discount for time served when she lived in San Antonio that summer. Okay, sold. She can have the night off. Oh my god, it worked! Yeah. But you'll have to find a loner. Uh, yeah? A replacement act. We can't be understaffed. Yeah, but that sounds like work. We kind of want to avoid that as much as possible, right? Just find a musician. <laughs> and don't just go and get any waterlogged corpse that's not at home watching TV, okay? No, definitely not these. It'll be, uh, top shelf. I should, I'll cryptically add this. Think about the risk here, potentially, before you zip off to Never Never Land and fetch some Sarcoline crooner. What risk? The first word a human being ever said was property. I should know. I was there at it. I've bought souls for a baby's breath, and I've bought souls for a ham sandwich. The only difference was the stuff they thought they were getting in return. 
And for someone like Linda, who's so dog-shaking desperate to get out of a contract, that she'd send two souls who ain't been dead not 17 minutes to bargain with me? Well, I think the plan deserves scrutiny is all. Maybe check it for ticks before you scamper off on the songbird's behalf. Don't let her sell you out, kids. I see bad contracts signed every day. Well, what the fuck did she mean by that? <laughs> I only understood like half the damn words. Sarkaline crooner? Uh, I think she's saying that Linda could stab us in the back or something. Maybe like trick us into switching places with her. No, she wouldn't do that, right? We don't you even don't know, know her. don't know what Linda Landon is capable of, children. But don't lose your concentration. Now, Ono requires a replacement performance if you want her freed up for the party. And don't even daydream about returning until you do. All right. Now we just have to find some singers and uh, convince them to do this. You listen to more modern day pop garbage than I do, so maybe you should take the lead. Yeah, makes sense. Let's find some musicalists. All right. Ooh, what about you? For his playing two guitars at the same time style, the Grand Duke of Hell, Astaroth, grew to musical prominence in the late 1970s before retiring from the stage to become a model train conductor. Hmm. I guess we're headed back upstairs. Get any musicians up here, maybe? Yo, 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 I feel like we really fucked that up. Yo, yo, I know. Maybe we'll get another chance someday to really impress her. Greetings and salutations, my classic oh, what do you know? pop enthusiasts. If you want to be our manager, we're trying to get Ono to take us on, so... No offense, but we'd rather keep trying with her. Yeah. We're here to offer you another opportunity to ascend to the musical heights I know you're capable of. A gig? Want to play for Ono tonight? It's a one-time thing, but it's real. Holy shit. Hold up. Wait, no. What is this for? Are we getting paid? Um... <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. Never. Of course not. Absolutely not. No. You are not getting paid. Oh, no, God. No, no, no. Great. Let's just declare my 1099. Saves me a little bit of a... <laughs> <laughs> Great. Ono just wants to... Uh... Let's drive it first, so we'll meet you downstairs when we're ready. Guess it's fine. Meet you down there. <laughs> Saloka, you're hired. Speaking of headaches, do you, uh, Peyton, do you have any more of those pills? Let's get another drink. Something? Let's see, we've got the Black Death to become a witty asshole. Our signature leprous lager, 16 full ounces of distilled bubo fluid? What? <laughs> Wait, eh, how to train your dragon? Is that what it's called? <laughs> I don't know the dragon's name. I never watched that movie. It, wait, isn't the dragon's name Toothless? Why do I know that? Okay, Jeffrey Bomber, lovable lush, scalding black turpentine brewed tea, whiskey garnished with fragrant durian. Okay, but that actually sounds really good. Just, uh, maybe not turpentine. Yeah, toothless! <laughs> Again, I've <laughs> never seen that. Student of Prague, a dash of pox, and a dead man's toe. A cult favorite! <laughs> Break. Yeah. <laughs> and then we've got our margarita. Let's get the Jeffrey Bomber. A Jeffrey Bomber is what I want to drink. What? Why are these called Jeffrey Bomber when they just turn me into a fun flirt? I don't know, man. I don't know. All right, let's go. Hi, Linda. 
Okay. Hey, do you have a personal demon by chance? I was just wondering if you had any advice. Oh yeah, Sister Wendy's snake nail, I think, tonight. Ooh, they're pretty a good. a lot of fog machines. Likes I to go to, to the mother-daughter well a lot. You know, feeling dismissed, like you're their only outlet, etc. They're hard to ignore, but get easier to make fun of with time. Hi, Linda. Hey. Hey, just out of curiosity, did anyone else answer the bigger post before us? Yeah, one guy swung by about an hour before you, claimed he played electric bagpipes, could charm Ono into letting me go. What happened? I haven't seen him since. Oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> That's a good tip. <laughs> Hi, Linda. Hey. Uh, maybe we just won't say anything? Just checking in. See you later. Let's go back downstairs. And in through the bar. Uh, book them for the 8th. Oh, no, the 7th. Of August? It's the dry period. No, not the month. The 8th circle. 7th. 7th circle. I keep saying we should switch to a day calendar. The system you have is... And tell him the next time he comes alley-catting around yowling for a higher percentage that I will personally... Well, not personally, but I will, you know, direct someone to personally rip his intestines out. <laughs> and then I'll... And this part I'll do. I'll, I'll knit them into something. Um, something like, uh... What do you not want your intestines knit into? Um, like a, a throw blanket. Like an ugly throw blanket. Okay, well, not that, but something like that. We, uh, we found people to, uh, to play tonight. Really? Yeah. Really? Uh, Black House? Yo, yo, yo! It's Black House in the house! Oh, Lord, not again. Thanks for the encore! Yo, yo! We won't let you diggity diggity down. Oh, come on, they'll be fine. They had their practice runs, and now they're ready for the big show, right, guys? Yo, yo, yo! Yo, yo, yo! Yeah, you don't have to answer that. They're ready. We're ready. Yeah, I don't know about this. Maybe with some uh, taxi dancers. I mean, this, it, it needs some elasticity to it. Dancers. This isn't Studio 54. I wish it was Studio 54. If you can't sing, Valak, you dance. If you can't dance, you set things on fire. That's the rule of rock and roll. <laughs> and no one is gonna watch obscenity peddlers rap like their brains are on strike unless things are humping each other in the background while they do it. So, Milo and Lola, wanna stand in for me? Oh. Wait, what, what, what's happening right now? You're gonna dance while your chosen artists perform. But just oh, Shadow no. Valak, he'll show you what to do. Oh no. I just need to see it in a group, you know? It's Punchy oh, LaRue all have over asked again. Me to do this when I was still jogging. Valak here has been wanting to dance on the Buddy Dean show since he was in Pigtails. He choreographs most of the numbers that come through here. Buddy Dean couldn't handle me, honey. You two. It'll be easy. Oh no. Just follow the moves as I go along. Okay. And don't deviate. I didn't study La Sonnambula in college for nothing. Hey, all right. I've been looking for an excuse to show off my, uh, <laughs> my moves, you know? Yes, your moves. Oh, It'll no. be all right, Milo. Just like the, the, the talent show we talked about. You in sixth grade? Oh, you mean the one you couldn't even say anything about because you were so embarrassed by the Did memory of kiss? it. Oh my god, what? Wait, 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 wait. Don't start the show without me. I always love live dancing. <laughs> Are you guys gonna show Bush or is it just tits up? Oh my god, what? will you fuck off, Wormhorn? We don't need this shit right now. <laughs> Are you sure you wanna do this? Lola's right. I mean, Milo, do you really remember the sixth grade talent show? That didn't turn out so well, did it? <laughs> I mean, let's be honest. Lil Chad Leckler beat you up so bad you had to take off school. Wait, Aww. Milo, you said you got the flu. Honestly, he was throwing up so much. It's not that big of a lie. 
Well, watch me shine now, motherfucker. I watch old MTV Spring Break videos all the time. It's simple. Just move like I move. Okay, we can Whatever, do this, y'all. Come on. My bones are falling asleep here. Let's uh, get this show on the freeway. Play the music. All right. Here we go. Yo, 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 yo. Turn it up. Turn it up. Yeah. yeah turn up the face a little. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. Uh -huh. That's the shit. It really is like. <laughs> Turn it down, actually. Turn, turn it out of the base a little. Yes, <laughs> okay, here. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, got it. God damn it. Dad, it's more fun for me. There we go. Yeah. Into the groove here. Okay, whatever. Give me a little, a little lick here. Here it is. You're worse than I thought you'd be. Oops. Turn up the vocals a little bit. Turn, turn up the vocals. <laughs> Find my place. Okay, yeah, there we go. Is that right? That was right? Ugh, okay. I can't hear myself. I, okay, yeah, that's, that's good. This is Come on, make it interesting. Wait, wait, yo, yo, I got some first words. <laughs> okay, you got the first verse. <laughs> Yeah, keep it. There Turn it down is. the yeah. now. Be good. Be bad. What is it's this? <laughs> okay, whatever. <laughs> My name is. Oh, the track's over. We did it. Yeah. Oof. I knew I shouldn't have stopped playing basketball at the Y. Did we do it? Very nice. I can. I can see it. I really can. With professionals, <laughs> it'll really distract from the horrifying music. We impressed you. Yo, 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 thank you, dog. She wasn't talking about you. Oh, well, Miss Ona, what, what did you think? <laughs> oh. Hmm, better than I expected. Uh, what? That's it? They sucked. Ugh. Whatever. Now that that bit of unpleasantness is in our rear view, I'll let you unfurl the banners. Tell Linda she's free for the evening. Great, awesome, thank you. Valak will riddle out the details. I imagine you'll be going to Morning Stars now. Uh, Satan's, yeah. Ah, yes, to try to outdrink him, get back home. Do you think you'll be able to do it? The two of you. Even if I had uh, misgivings, we have to try. It's the only way out we've heard of, uh, so far. Lucifer was the first rock star. You know, before Liz, before Paganini, before that caveman that played a dinosaur's rib cage like a xylophone. It was him. And notoriety makes you forget things. Responsibilities to yourself and others. And look, he has bigger things to worry about tonight than a drinking contest. Responsibilities like what? It's just... Uh... Every human creature carries microscopic mites. Mites that live full, hectic, provocative lives. They fall in love, have children, die tragically. And I say this not to make you itch. I say this so that when you see rock stars and movie stars and people with jets, when you meet Satan, remember that you are all planets responsible for a billion souls. And so is he. And what else could be more important than that? Say hi to Linda for me. We'll be in touch. Okay, I'm bye. Uh, weirdly glad we did that. It was just, I don't know. Felt good. Well, I'm glad for you. Now let's give Linda the good news and get her damn invite. Let's go. Let's down this drink. Hell yeah. Well, if it isn't my favorite fans again. Vickers blowing up about the reunion. Apparently, they all just arrived. It's funny. I was thinking maybe there'd be a chance Hedgy Jane Myers would end up, you know, north. She was running some fucking Save the Giraffes PSA campaign last I saw. Anyways, how'd the search for a last minute understudy go? Seeing as how this is hell, it probably didn't go so well. See? Oh, I can't I'm stop. We got you like literally the worst thing. It's 
They're just horrible. Oh no, these, said it was... uh, rappers, they, they, they really I don't like know. Sex with. Doesn't matter what they're into. Just matters that they'll be on that stage for you tonight. You're off the hook. Huh. I'm surprised. And it's hard to surprise someone who gets leeches put in her coffee every morning. Come on, walk me to the cab stand. I have to say, I thought this was going to be like baking cookies. You plan on making these perfect little Christmas trees and they come out looking like somebody's father issues. But you guys really pulled oh it off. God. And uh, I'm a little embarrassed to say my elbows are sweating at the thought of meeting my old bandmates. Those bastards have gone on so long without me. Well, I mean, they did sound like jerks. Maybe set expectations to work reunion or even divorce counseling. It's just, we were like best friends, you know? And they did kind of screw me over, but... I don't know. I kind of screwed them, too. By, uh, hogging the attention? Yeah, well, that. And by embezzling album profits. But be that as what? it may, I just hope we can remember why we became friends in the first place. Linda! That is not cool. Last time I saw Bobby Francis, we got in a fight over what to name our tour van stuffed monkey mascot. I told him his name is Rico, or I'll see you in hell. <laughs> you think he'll remember? Milo, Bobby couldn't remember his daughter's name while we were on tour. No, Wait. he will not remember. What happened to the third guy? There's only two guys here now. Friendships that long are like a marriage. Sometimes you just want to boil a person's face off and shoot the EMTs as they come, but well, dying alone is just too scary to even entertain the alternative. Well, we can't remember dying, so I guess I'll take your word for it. Whether you remember isn't the important part. You're not dead until there's nobody left that remembers you. That's why everybody wants to be famous. Milo wanted to be famous. No, I didn't. Why would you say that? Uh, you know what? I don't know. Just popped into my head. Ah, uh, don't worry about it. There's a demonic saying. The longer in hell, the more you are, you are. It means... Eh, who gives a fuck what it means? Let's just get out of here. This is the long pathway. Like, it feels longer going back than going towards the bar. <laughs> True. <laughs> Look at that. We made it, though. Hey, uh, thanks a lot for this. Uh, just give the door gal my name. See you in there. Rock and roll. Awesome. awesome. We are awesome. awesome. Yeah. Okay. So we should just go to Satan's then. We are right? awesome. Like, hey, what's up? Let's just, uh, let's drink you down. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, yeah. Let's just, uh, like a band aid. Quick and easy. Right off. Right off. Sure. Yeah. Quick and easy. Yep. It's time for your review! What do you mean, review? <laughs> or a psychological assessment, or bumblefeed personality quiz. Excuse me? Whatever you want to call it. First of all, 
You intentionally chose to be a drink mule for somebody named Linda. True. Instead of aiding that poor little demon who needed help apprehending a dangerous homo sapien. I didn't Either realize. Either thought this sounded more fun or Lola likes just blindly following my way around. I Which, just thought. Either way. I mean, getting a vodka soda for someone does sound simpler. Hey, bug nut, the plan worked. We're, we're going Oops. to Satan's party. All right, all right, all right. So you needed to find a band to fill Linda's slot. Which saps did you enlist? Oh, wait, I was there, so I already know. It was Black House. <laughs> Why the fuck did you pick these guys? You know the instant Ono sobers up, she's gonna realize you traded three-day-old coffee for curdled rat milk. <laughs> I mean, have you heard their songs? Or is rubbing muskrats on your junk something that interests you? Hey, Ono made the deal herself, I, okay? I don't know. I'm not gonna feel sorry that we swindled the, the demon that invented swindling or whatever. Ah, I guess we'll see if you can maintain your apathy when she circles the wagon back for a renegotiation. Okay, factoid time! Thought you might want to know what's going on in the land of the living. So, while you were busy accomplishing this very important mission, instead of, you know, getting your ass off the fucking couch and contributing to society in any sort of meaningful way, one Vlado Gavajic lost his hand in a factory farm accident in Lenawee County, Michigan. What the hell? Due to lax regulations, his meat will be served along with the other 93,000 cows slaughtered today. Oh, good. Uh, really? 3,856 people died. In their entire lives, only 47 non-consecutive hours of true happiness was felt in my mouth. <laughs> How sad. Wormhorn. And, of course... Ah, uh, wait, sorry. Those are out of order. Wormhorn. <laughs> Milo? Won that dancing thing on the first try, you giant-ass dork? Who the hell is good at this stupid shit? Get a life! <laughs> get us out of here, Wormhorn. We need to get on with our night before we're stuck here forever. So? <sighs> Fine. I'll text you. I'll talk to you later. Ow. Jeez. All right. We need Sam to drive us. So let's call Sam. Hey, someone order a ferry? Had to go with Miss Landon. What a long face. Personal demon dragging down. Listen, just remember, those things are like car sickness. Just keep your eyes on the horizon, it'll go away on its own. And sometimes you just need to deal with it to get to the mall, you know? Anyways, did you get the invitation? We did, actually. Get the fuck out of here. A whole VIP kept the entire line invitation for an already free drink? What did she really want? We had to uh, find a band to play her time slot. What band? I don't even worry about it. It wasn't two deranged rappers, was it? You're psychic. Uh -oh. You're psychic. It's all over, Vicar. Oh, cool. Anyways, I imagine you'll be wanting to go to Satan's now, right? <laughs> Finish the game. I, I mean, whatever. That's a sick billboard, though. I mean, honestly. Oh, we gotta go back over here. Wait, can we... Oh. See... I kind of thought that it was like I expected it to be a little like oxen free where you get to travel the entire map it doesn't matter who you save first you know what I mean because you can do all of it no apparently we could go to Linda or the demon no and so whoops <laughs> Right? Open underworld! Exactly! Like, come on! <laughs> okay, I know! The choices matter! I made a mistake! <laughs> it was a bad idea! I didn't mean to! <laughs> um, I will try to learn Welcome from it. Alright, your request is my, uh, my, my thing that you do when requested them or something. Let's go. We just get to out drink Satan. We get a party harder than him, alright? We can do it. I believe. Every man will have his favorite day, but few will know about them. This will... This should be one of your favorite days, I think. A uh, camel hair better, at least, than bottomless fries Friday. A VIP invitation to Saint's house party. That's, uh... You guys are doing... You're doing well. You, you, you're doing good. I don't have any poppers or noisemakers, so hopefully the ride in my 
genuine amazement will suffice. Hey, I mean, we couldn't have done it without your help, Sam. You were the steed to our to our gallant knights. <laughs> what? Yeah, and a uh, word of advice, if you make it back topside, maybe don't talk like that at your first job interviews. Oh yeah, when we get back, we'll be like adults. Oh, a little nervous about rolling over from Miss and Mister to Ma'am and Sir. And uh, depending on your income level, either having to read train schedules or caring about the estate tax. No, it's it's not it's not leaving school so much as Milo and I have known each other forever. Yeah, like genuinely forever. We got paired up in preschool because we were the last picked in a buddy system. Oh. And while Milo stayed in town to help his mom in her magic shop. Lola's moving across the country to live with her dad. Sounds like you guys are just erupting with excitement over all the new opportunities afforded by your continued cellular reproduction. <laughs> yes, Absolutely. definitely. Absolutely. Without a doubt. So, completely switching topics. Satan's party, huh? Very exciting. Top shelf. Top shelf! Golden Coliseum, Yang Zoo on opium. Mother, don't look at these pictures and stuff. Put away the Ouija boards and voodoo dolls, kids. Because anyone that'll be answering is too busy getting their nipples twisted. Why don't you take a break and join us? I'm not waiting in that line. Well, if we find an extra invite, we'll just, uh... I'm not exactly the partying type, kids. I drink alone. Or with one other person. Yeah. I guess fair enough. That sounds nice. Alright, candleflies. Have fun. Candleflies? Yeah, enjoy yourselves. Thanks. And, uh, before you scamper off, two things, okay? One. Sam, sorry. Are you, are you on tonight? Are you? Where are you headed? Sixth circle. Lucifer didn't show up for the inspection last week. And now I gotta make sure the stone coffins are being heated properly. Like, I don't have enough poop to worry about. Yeah, seems like it's a death style now. Wait, sorry, what's your job, exactly? Wider-ganger, sweat cooker of infidels. This is Milo and Lola, recently deceased. Yeah, congratulations. I'm foreman down to coffin mines in the city of death. We slow roast heretics and serve them with a creamy potato bake, along with Brussels sprouts. Ooh, creamy potato. I'll get the recipe later. Anyways, can you help me out? I know it's out of the way. I'll give you a ride. Great, thanks. I'd swim, but the lava starts hurting if you're in it for too long. Wait, Sam, what were your two things, uh, two pieces of advice? Was I gonna give you two? That seems excessive. How about one? No. I'll give you one. No, give us two. You hear the first thing I was gonna say? One for each of us. Ah, uh, sorry. We just ran out of time for both. Because of this washing bear. Uh, the second? Don't be intimidated by Morningstar. Satan? He's tall. He's had kings and queens commit atrocities in his name. Then you can thank him for the hurricanes winning the Stanley Cup in 06. But at the end of the day, he's still just a boy. With worries. Um, okay. Text me if you need to ride somewhere. Okay. <laughs> Uh, what do you think Sam meant by that? He's just a boy with worries. That was a weird thing to say, right? Like, he's probably not just a boy with worries. She's just saying he's probably, like, insecure about something, you know? Like, like everyone has something they're worried about, and it doesn't matter how rich or powerful they are. Oh, like that guy in a nice suit I saw crying on the street after he dropped his taco. Yeah. Yeah, I'm sure he has his problems. I would cry if I dropped my taco, though. Like, really. That would just be horrible. But, uh, you know... Y'all, uh, my little candle flies, is that what she said? <laughs> oh my god. We're gonna go ahead and call it there for the evening. It seems like a, a good place to stop for now, but, um, oh, oh my. Okay. Thanks for bringing that up, by the way, uh, and for reminding me to read that. I have that. I've been setting my books out like they're still in a box from the last time we moved. And uh, I just, anyway, I have a copy of that. Um, but more importantly, Stephen's read that and has told me about it. And um, God, I lost my train of thought. But it's, it is. It's so fascinating. From what I know of it. I haven't read it. 
all yet. I did start the first one, but anyway. Haven't finished it. But I agree. So far from what I've read, it's a fascinating read. Ow. Okay. Um, actually, that would... <laughs> uh, that would probably... It probably help to be a little more familiar with it. Playing this game, I mean, you know? There's probably quite a few things, as usual, that are just going right over my head. But, you know. That's alright, I suppose. <laughs> uh, y'all. My, my brain is dead. So, I'm gonna just go ahead and get off for the night but um i hope you had a good time tonight it's an interesting game so far i hope you're enjoying it we're making so many choices i'm paying attention zerloka to the choices from here on i will do my best okay <laughs> oh. but i do hope y'all had a good time um we will continue tomorrow we'll, we'll we'll keep playing after party we'll continue tomorrow after seven hopefully not too late as late as we started tonight, but, uh, uh, after 7 p.m. tomorrow. So, <laughs> y'all have a good night, have, or a morning, <laughs> whatever. Oh my god, whatever the fuck it is, wherever you are, be kind to yourself and to others, all right? Please stay safe and take care, okay? I, oh, my words are blending together. Okay, I'll see you back here tomorrow. Grimoire after party. Adventures in hell. <laughs> Good night, everyone.